So this morning, as you will notice, my voice is a little raspy, as it was yesterday. Some have asked, what's going on? What's wrong? And I tell them simply that it's pollen. It's that time of year when the things that are blooming get me, get me and cause me to have irritated throat. Well, that's life. Do I ask for help? Uh, no. I never even think about asking for help sometimes, and my children will tell you that I'm very stubborn when it comes to getting and asking for help. I thought about that this morning in relationship to me and God and others, and I thought about Paul. Paul in 2 Corinthians write that he had a problem, and he went to God three different times, and God gave him the same answer each time. My grace is sufficient. In your weakness, my power is seen. I don't know why we don't ask for God. I don't know why I don't ask from God. But I do. I don't ask from other people. I try to do things on my own. I'm very independent. Perhaps it's pride. Perhaps that's what it is. But I don't always know that it is. I think there's other things that are in that mix. I wonder this morning, though, are you one who well, doesn't ask for help, that doesn't seek out God. I think Paul is wonderful that he asked three times. I don't think I would have asked three times. I think I would have asked once and gotten a no and, well, not done it, gone any further. But he persisted. As this morning I was doing my devotions, I thought about my situation right now and thought, have I even asked God to heal this? The answer is no, I haven't. So I did. He hasn't answered me yet. He hasn't healed me either. But I'm going to keep knocking. I'm going to keep trying. The point of all of this is, is that we sometimes become too independent. Maybe we need to rely upon the one who is able more than the one who is unable, which is us. Think about that today, would you? Hey, until next time, God bless.